we're going to make some eggplant bacon. And to do that, you need to have a nice looking eggplant. You pick them by the color, that they're uniform in color, and that they don't have any picks or notches on the bacon, or the eggplant. I cut off the top, throw it away, and I use my little mandolin, and I'm going to slice my bacon. Now, I really like to use uh, Asian eggplant because it's long and skinny and looks more like bacon when it's cut. And then I'm going to take my thin, my thin little slices and I'm going to layer them in my pan. And just an interesting fact is that they think it might be able to lower cholesterol. The reason they think this is because they had, did a study where they gave rabbits who had high blood cholesterol some eggplant juice and their cholesterol was reduced. And not only was their cholesterol reduced, their arteries were able to improve the blood flow. I just put some salt on there and I'm going to put some of my oil. Bacon is really oily and salty, so use as much or as little as you like. I'm going to use some vinegar. And then the secret to this is grapefruit. I'm going to squeeze some grapefruit juice, and I'm going to do this on every layer until my pan, my pan is full. I'm going to cover my pan, place a heavy weight on it, and let it marinate at least overnight. And then I will take my marinated eggplant and place it on a dehydrator tray and dry it for about 12 hours. Now there is a little trick about this. Because it will come out oily, it will only last a short period of time because the oil will rehydrate the bacon and it will become soft and not stay crunchy. This is your finished completed project.